Just saying. You know, I mean, he has what he probably doesn't share with me. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. Okay. All right. So we're going to open a can after I eat my whoopie pies. <laughs> I better move those out of your <laughs> way. You're not going to be able to reach anything. No sharp edges here, here. I'm going to drop this into the garbage. The same mechanism, I'm going to flip this and actually open up pull tabs like so. Then I'm going to flip it again and use the stainless steel bottle opener to open that up. Then I'm going to flip it again. One liter, two liter, three liter bottles have all the same side. Make sure it's not shaken. One liter, two liter, three liter bottles. One liter, two liter, three liter All these years, he just thought of that song. And pop that out, okay? And then last but not least, those metal jars, being able to open it up. And look at that, boop, all in one. The classic can opener that has not changed in 15 years, the same mechanism with no exposed blade, but it's all at the ready in great colors. Now, I'll tell you about colors. We've got this for you, and if you want to pick up more than one of these, I know it may sound a little odd on the face of it, but these make great stocking stuffers. Yep, they really do. Because think about it, everybody needs this kind of thing in their kitchen, and they probably have two or three or four tools that do all this. Mm -hmm. What if they could get rid of all those and replace it with one? Now, I've got it for you in spice. I have it for you here in aquamarine. This is olive. Olive. This is the color that I have in my kitchen. I have the black one. And then we also have it for you in the red. Red is most popular, $19.96. And the reason I suggest more than one of these, Mark Charles, yep. is to buy more, save more. Yeah. You're going to be able to save $3 on every one that you buy after the first one. So pay full price for the first one and then $3 less for every one you buy after that. And before, this was, that the is not true. this was the only choice. This is the only choice that you, you had as mm. far as a can opener. With the blades. Okay, we're going to double check on the buy more, save more because okay. I had that on my card. Okay. okay. Uh, the blade was always exposed and it touched the food. It created sharp edges. It actually cross contaminated, breeded bacteria, and created microscopic shavings of metal in your food every time you open it. That's why people who had pets used to have a pet can opener and a people can opener because they would cross contaminate. With this can opener, it's auto attach. It will never cross contaminate. Let me show you how to open up a can. You want to talk about the card first? I or? do. I want to okay. let you know that on a $19 item, you can put it on three easy payments if you have a Q card. So remember, your Q card is going to allow you to put this or any item except gift cards mm -hmm. on three easy payments. So take advantage of that three easy payment plan. And uh, I am told now that that information about buy more, save more is not accurate here. And I apologize for the confusion there. No buy more, save more on this. Okay. But you can put it on three pay if you're using your Q card. All right. Now, let's talk about the other ways you'll use this. Okay. So here's the thing. We're used to the traditional way. That's how it cuts into the can and makes the, it touches the food. We're going to go up top. And actually auto attach. So I took this little tomato paste to show you that even the little to tomato paste, it catches. Now I always say to leave the can opener in place and let the can actually turn around. You notice that little bit right there? That's the opening part. That's actually uncrimping the can. And you're gonna take that little bird beak and go on the edge. Tweet, See tweet. that? And you're able to pull that off. And what's important to note is not only do you have no sharp edges there, you have no sharp edges here, which a traditional can opener would always give you. I'm going to go over to the garbage can and show you that I dropped that in. But more importantly, look at what's on this can opener. Not a drop of that tomato paste. Not a drop. And here's the secret. So now I can open up dog food and go right to baby formula because it's a different way of opening up a can. No cross contamination, no breeding of bacteria, no sharp edges. It just makes sense for something we all need to do open cans. Well, I need to let you know that 700 of these are now gone. Let's go through color choices yep. again, beginning with spice. 900 left to go around in this spice. I also have it in aquamarine. Here it is in the olive. Black is the color I have in my kitchen. And then many of you I know are picking up the red one today. In fact, it's our most popular choice. Foodie red. You may want to pick up more than one of these and think about them as great stocking stuffers and gift ideas for a foodie on your gift list because everybody has a can opener of one shape or form or another. Mm -hmm. You have to have it. But this is going to be an easier one to use and one that's certainly more hygienic. And I think it's the best. Yeah. So the fact is, you've got this great can opener. We put four other features on there. So the can opener is the primary pur purpose. If you're going to move over here, there's four other features on this. You see this little guy over here? That's called the parrot beak because 60% of the cans are coming out to be pull tabs especially like uh, pet food. Watch this. Now you don't need to have fingernails or anything. You pull it up and you're able to open that up easily and keep your hands away from the sharp edge. More importantly, you're not in the food or touching anything. Again, no food contamination there. So there's the little parrot beak for that's the number two reason. Number three, of course, is you always need a stainless steel bottle opener, whether it's alcoholic or non, at the ready. So it's not plastic, so it's not going to pit on you or crack. And it's never going to rust on you. So you get a great stainless steel bottle opener there. All right. I'm just passing out some whoopie pies here. Don't to everybody. leave mine. Uh, hello. Don't You're going to get yours. Steve, you want a whoopie pie? 
don't forget about no, mine. Not for you. Pop and it. then what the other, the next thing is that the tops. Do you know that a personal water bottle, two liter, three liter bottle, have the same size caps? What you do is sit that on top, and I say twist the bottle. Watch this. If you just twist the bottle, you don't need any extra leverage because this actually breaks that seal. Look, I'm doing it with my fingertips. I can actually break that seal, that tough seal there, and it pops right out. So there's the fourth feature. And the last and really what I think a great feature is metal lidded jars are vacuum sealed at a factory. See this little hook right here? That little hook means that you can go underneath. Watch this. And I don't know if you can hear it. Oh, and it actually opens up and takes that pressure That's right great. off there. Five in one, ready to go. This is the classic can opener I've been selling for 15 years on QVC. Mm -hmm. It's never needed to change the mechanism because it's a tried and true mechanism that's the best of the best. So that's te te the test of time. 1,700 of these are gone. I have spice, aquamarine, olive, black, and red. I also have, oh, you don't get a bite yet. Trivia. Okay. And if you get the trivia question right. No, I'm getting this regardless of being right. You or not. get to enjoy the whoopie pie. Mary, I need you to get the whoopie pie.